I think I know them all already. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. Ready? Beer, 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 pa beer, pa beer, beer, beer. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to me, May Peruski, for the Ruski Bruski not review, but beer guessing game. We got Jordan here as well. You saw in the last video, he brought four beers for me to try out. And uh, happened happened to be me guessing them all correct after the cans were put out. I knew exactly where each one would go. Uh, going in fully blind, a little bit more challenging for sure, but uh, pretty man, close. Pretty close. Pretty close. Fully blind. Now it's now it's your turn to run right. the four beer all right, here we go. Let's see. Okay. Let's sip on the previous ones. I'm getting like a, like a, like a very oaty. Okay. Like lots of oats. Okay. Actually, not much, not much smell actually on that one. All right. Okay. Okay. Oh wow, caramel. A little bit of orange tang. Okay. This one's alright. Okay, this one might be a little tough. Let's see. Mm. Hold on. No worries. I'm still, I'm still surprised at all these beers actually. Yeah, this is also very. Uh, there's a little bit of caramel, a little bit of orange spice. A bit some spice to it. Just your palate, just smell your elbow as well. This one, this one's strong. Yeah? This one's really strong for smell. All right. Okay. Do you think, do you think, you, do you want to take a sip before you guess the style or do you think you know the style? Um, okay, what's, what's the style of Rickard's Red? Red Ale. Red Ale, and then yeah. the style of uh, Muskoka Detour. Um, Detour? Detour yeah. is like a... Uh, or the, sorry, the, the, like a cream ale? The cream ale. What, uh, what, what's, what's that? We do like a cream ale. Cream ale. So yeah. red ale and cream ale? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I think the only beers... Oh, and, and, and what's an IPA? What's an example of an IPA? An IPA would be... Uh, is, there, is there a dark IPA? There is, right? Like a, a bone yeah, 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 bone shaker is a darker IPA. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, those are like like a West Coast, okay. the West Coast style, so they are a little darker. Okay, okay. Okay, I definitely want to say that that these two are red ales. I definitely okay. want to say that. All right. Like, yeah. Um, okay. And I'm not too sure about these yet. I'm not too sure. Right. This one's really strong smell. Okay, cool. cool. Really, really strong smell. I'm actually really curious here. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see how okay, you Okay, I want to say that this is like, I've had this, I have, I've had this beer so many times. Okay. Like right away when I smelt it, mm -hmm. I was like, I've had this beer so many times. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. Cool. Okay, this is a Muskoka, there's no doubt. Okay. There's no doubt in my mind. <sighs> what is it, cream? Okay, but no, it's not cream. Where's the cream one? This is fun. It's fun being on the other side. Because <laughs> <laughs> Nick knows I know. He knows I know. Okay. One of those three. To Rickards, Creamore, or... Uh, it's too dark for Creamore. Okay. Too, too ambery. But this, this is a lot of haze, man. Wow, this is caramel galore. Yeah. Wow. 
Wow. Mm. Actually, 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 this this one is um, this one, um, for, this is Lake of Bays. This is Lake of Bays right out. I'm almost certain, actually. Beer. Mm. Um, yeah, this one I feel like this one had a very distinct. Uh, this one is this one. This one's a major. This one's a major exporter. Okay, this is a big one. Chocolatey, hazelnut. All right. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I've also had this beer a lot with you too. Okay. We've had this beer many times together. Hmm. This is this is Muskoka. Well, I'll have to wait and see. <laughs> There's actually no records right at this table. Okay. There's no records right. What do you think about that one? <laughs> Smells way different than the flavor. Really? This is like like water. Okay. Okay, so this okay, this is gonna be the uh, fuck, honestly, I I can't remember how my records looks. This is this is this is a this is a major exporter. This is a big brand beer. All right. This is really fun to do. Holy hell! It's nice being on the other side. I'm trying to make give you like nothing about these. Yeah, dude. This is very watery. Not much flavor. Heavy smell though. Hmm. But I think it's the I think it's the glass actually because these glasses for some reason the water gets stuck at the bottom and it gives you like that water smell. So, okay. Oh yeah. Like yeah, water. maybe I picked that. Yeah. Does this one have the same issue with no. the smell? Like some of them, some of them have it, but yeah. Okay. Dude, this has. Okay, this is a big. This is a big exporting beer. This is like uh, your cream Mori Ricard Red. Um, I'm trying to think what other big, big and, and it's, this is maybe like a five percent ABV, uh, not too high IBUs, very low IBUs, maybe like twenty five. Yeah. This is, uh, I'm trying to put the name on it, man, but this is a very, I think when you bring it out, I'll be able to pinpoint that right away. Okay. This as well. When I see the name of the beer, I'll be able to pinpoint it right away. These two are super tricky. Okay. This is, this is great. This is a really yummy beer. Yeah, yeah. This is a right. really, really good beer. Lots of chocolate, lots of, uh... Interesting. Okay. This is your detour. That's Detour. This, I'm not too sure, and I'm not too sure, but I know the name when I'll see it. Wait, Detour, or are you thinking the other one? Which other one? The Cream Ale. I'm thinking Detour, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Or maybe it is a Cream Ale. It's some, it's some type of Muskoka. Wait, do you remember what the Detour was? I know, I know both. Okay. Okay. Yeah, the, the detour is the the yellow, like the, the creamy can with like the blue writing on it. Okay. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Um. Well, this is this is Muskoka beer. Okay. This is a main. This is a main exporter. Okay. This one. So much caramel in here. So much caramel. Mm. I like it a lot. Nice. Nice. I like it a lot. This one. I've had this beer. I've had this beer. You 
ready for me to put uh, yeah, the hands? I'm ready. I'm, I'm, right, I'm, so, I'm so, going to get them right away. I'm going to get okay, them right so, away. So, so, so final verdict, what do you think each of them are before I go grab those cans? Okay. Okay, I don't, know the, I, I don't know the name of them, but I can say okay. Big Exporter. Okay. So like, let's say you have a big brand, that's going to be this one. Alright, we got Big Exporter here. Okay. Then we got some nice local brew. Nice okay. Cho- lots of chocolate notes in there. Um, there's a little bit of... Okay, this is a Muskoka beer. Okay. Like, it just... This is reeking Muskoka. This one... So, okay, so... Final verdict was... Big Exporter. Big Muskoka. Muskoka. Um, like a base, mm-hmm. and I'm not too sure. Okay, you want to go grab the yeah. cans? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, sounds good. Sounds good. I think I got these down pat, man. Right, let's see. Let's see. I got these ones down. All right, ready? Yeah. Here are the cans. Oh, ho, ho, look at this! Take a look at them, see which one look we're doing with them. Look at this! Okay, okay, like a base. Ooh. Oh, no way. Oh. oh Let's see how it changes, wow. changes it up. Wow. Or if it changes it up. Wow, no Muskoka's in here. No Muskoka. But you were close. You're, yeah. you're, 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 you're on the right path of... of, of Royal s- City? Royal S- yeah, I think that's out of a glow. Oh, I can't, I can't taste it. I almost took a sip. Yeah, I know. The times where I was going for the okay. can. <laughs> oh, this is tough now. Mm-hmm. But, you, but did you oh, notice the, the style of each one? Yeah, 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 I did. I did. I, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Damn. <coughs> Yeah, no worries. Oh my god, Nick. Dude, are you kidding me? Not at all. Are these all red L's? Yeah. But that like that was the, that's the coolest thing, is like look at how much variation in color there is. I know, I know, I know. Okay, this one's tough. Is this local brew? They're from uh, Royal City. That's Guelph. Guelph, Guelph. Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's the only one I think you may not have had in the past. Okay. Okay. But I just got it because I think a dollar from each can goes to the goes to uh, vet, Veterans Affairs or something or uh, Wounded Warrior, sorry. So that, that's that's why I threw it in there. Okay. Yeah, okay, one second. Let me just make sure. Mm-hmm. Take your time. Sick too. So I have you know what time we've had this beer. Oh, I know. Every Listen. time we go to Jake's, it was always yeah. Rickards. Okay. okay, it's this one. That's the Rickards. Okay. Okay, I'm going here. I'm going with this here. Okay. One second. I shall make sure. Ha 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 ha! It's stressful, isn't Nick, it? Nick can't believe I'm getting them all right here. <laughs> Tell me when you when when you think you're set. You let me know, and then I'll reveal. No time limit, no need to. Okay, right away, Nick. Mm-hmm. As soon as I smelled that beer, I thought of like Gracie's O'Malley. Oh, okay. That's right. You just have there all the time. Yeah, yeah. So right off the bat, boom. I know it's not, like it's not a very hazy color like these two. Mm-hmm. So it's gonna be that one. Okay. I haven't had these, but knowing Lost Craft, they make more of like a. Not so, uh, like, hate more hazy, more hazy. Yeah, okay. Hazy. So it's not gonna be that one over there. So that's going there. Mm. And Lake of Base Pale Ale Red. That's the thing, see? Like, I think, okay, so I think I got these two right. Okay. It's either this mm-hmm. or it's this. So let me just, let me 
me just make sure here for a second. But I know, I know that for sure. I know for sure. It's one of it's one of those two combos. Okay. So we're just gonna put these to the side for now. All right. Okay. But you know what's amazing? Mm -hmm. This beer tastes so similar to Muskoka Brew. Really? It does. It does. I find so. It tastes so similar. It has like that Muskoka, -y, right? Okay. So, and let me try this one more time. This is very flat. Not a lot of flavor here. My, my nose might be getting a little skewed from the, the smell yeah, of the it glass. Takes, it, takes, it takes a toll, doesn't it? Yeah. But yeah, no, definitely the, the glass has a lot of influence right there. That's I should have picked a better glass. Final answer. Final answer? Locked in. All right, locked in. Locked in. Did I get him? Let, can you give me one more second? Give me one second. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I know what's good, and I do know what's good. <laughs> You're so fucking close. No way. You're so fucking close. No way. Oh. You killed it. That's awesome. <laughs> That's wow. perfect. Wow. That's. That was good. That was a hard one. That was a hard one. That was a hard one. That was good. That was a really hard one. There wow. you go. That was exciting, man. Yeah, when you when you were swapping these two back and forth, or uh, yeah, no, the, no, these two back and forth, I'm like these two beers. I'm like, I know he's got it. I know he's gonna get. It. And whenever you put Royal City on this one, I'm like, he knows he's wrong on that one. Yeah. Nice. Good stuff. Nice. Hey. Yeah. This one. This one's actually really good. Yeah, Ricky Red is always really amazing. This is really good. Mm -hmm. Well, like when you look at the Spark House and and the the Rick and Red, very similar in color. So similar, man. Mm -hmm. It's like little, they just took Rick and Red and made it made it their own. It had a very Muskoka flavor. Well, you're not wrong. I mean, they are from the Muskoka region, yeah. so yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. When you said Detour, I got really worried. Why? Which one's Detour? Detour is like their their session IPA. Yeah? Yeah, you got the can right, and that's where I'm like, are you sure? Okay, I should have been thinking Muskoka uh, cream ale. Yeah, I think you meant cream ale. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. gotcha. But yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow, man. That was awesome. Okay, now we actually have a lot of beer to crush right now. Yeah, we got, we got a good amount of beer. <laughs> Plus, we have the one more finale. That we do. That one I think is going to be a little, a little tougher. I was trying to think of, of what beers we've done. We'll figure it out. It should be a good time. Man, I'm happy. Hey, two, two out of four? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> Woo! Two out of four. Good yeah, stuff. Geez. A very, very tough, very tough panel. This was a tough panel. This was good. Mm -hmm. yeah, so we got Crimson, Lost Craft, we got Spark House, Lake of Bays, Royal City, Remembrance Red, and Classic. And classic. Classic Rickards Red. Rickards, baby. So all red ales, and this actually shows you a nice different color variation between <coughs> what red ales can be, with Remembrance being the most hazy, and uh, in a sense lightest red, moving over to the Crimson, and then Spark House is a touch lighter than Rickards, but very, very similar. <sighs> I think also very similar in taste, too. If I, I, I haven't never tasted them back to back. You know, it took me a while. I'm just like thinking, okay, what what beers do I think that like, you know, we'll, we'll have we'll have a good shot. It's just not just like something totally random. I'm thinking red ales. Jordan, we, like we know red ales because we drank a ton of Rickards Red. Yeah. And I'm thinking like, and I know I know you've been the, been to the cottage, and I'm pretty sure we've crushed some Lake of Bays. I knew Royal City. I don't think many people have had that I know of, but like. And then Crimson just goes. What, what are you, what are you laughing when I said I've had this one so many times? When yeah. I first smell, it's like I had this beer so many times. Right? Yeah, like he's gonna get it. He's either gonna put Rickers Red or Spark House because they're very, very similar. Yeah, dude, this one is so good. 
Holy cow. And you were right with this one when you said chocolate, because they use chocolate malt. Yeah. They also use roasted barley, which is in that baggie, the darkest mm. map, uh, the darkest malt. Gotcha. They use crystal. Mm. No, two row as well. Both, hey. Wait, let's try this. Yeah, Yo, go for it. This is so good. Do I remember it's red? Mm. Yeah. Did you have some? Oh, I've had like two cans, like three cans in the past month. Mm. Man, dude, they're so caramelly. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's a nice beer. Sip from the can. Big caramel. Bit, a little bit of orange peel too. Mm. Yeah. yeah. What's this? That's roasted barley. It would do. Did you see them? Just like that. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Okay, that's roasted barley. This is caramel 75. Mm -hmm. and this is two row. There's two row malt. This is caramel? Car yeah, caramel 75. So it's, a, it's, it's light, uh, it's lighter on the outside. Oh my god. But in the middle, it's very dark. So we're eating, we're eating malts. Where do, you, where do you buy some? I got these from a local craft brew store. They got little baggies of malt, and there's a two row. Um, this goes in beer? This is the flavor. Yeah, so in the Lake of Bays, they, they always put their malts. We got two row pale. So slightly different than this, but still similar. Uh, flaked wheat, crystal, doesn't say what kind of crystal, but it would be a variation of this. Mm -hmm. Chocolate malt and then roasted barley, which is the, the darkest one here. But there's many more flavors, right? In the world? Oh, there's a ton, yeah. Mm -hmm. well, these are your favorite? You no, know, these are just some that I picked up to work on a project. Like I was having to just uh, find information on different, different malts. Why, why did they come in this baggie? Or oh, no, I just it? put them in the bag. I got, uh, you got a tin. You know, I got a, a pound baggie of each. Each, you know, what it was for a pound of each? 99 cents. No, it's not. It was half off. A dollar? A dollar. For a pound. For a pound. For a pound. Mm hmm. I think it was like 40, 40, 42 bucks for like 25 kilograms. So you're saying I should swap out Miss Vicky's for. If you want to, yeah. For these. Yeah. These are good. They're nice, eh? Just close them before you eat them all. No, no, that's why I brought them over to eat them all, because I have the rest of the baggies at home. No, I don't, I don't want to eat them all. Well, I brought them for you. You want, you want me to eat them all right now? You don't have to eat them all right now. There's a lot going on. Dude, I'm, I'm gonna, I won't stop. That's fine. <laughs> They're good. That's, that's why I brought them over for you to eat. Right, thank you, thank you, mm -hmm. thank you. Or throw on salad or something. Wow. Okay, so there we have it. There we have it, guys. We did our first tasting test, and now we know what to expect for next time. Mm-hmm, yeah. How how it's gonna work out? How it's gonna work? That one went really smoothly. That was good. It was really good. Well, next we, next time it's gonna be even harder for you. I'm gonna make it a bit more challenging for you as well. I'm gonna make it really hard for you though. Yeah, I mean, four four beers is a good number. Yeah. I, stepping up to five maybe. We could do that. Mm -hmm. but what we're gonna do for you is get the exact same beers. Like everything is gonna be like exactly yeah. the same. Like, you know what? I'm gonna give you the red ale challenge next time. Actually. You're gonna give me the red ale challenge. Yeah. Okay. Just gotta find different red ales. Is there a lot? There's a lot. I, I honestly don't. Like, at the LCBO, not really. I think these were the only the ones that I could find. I'm trying to think of other red ales. Yeah, fuck it. We need the American beer lagers. Yeah, lagers. Diff different country lagers. That'd be interesting. Different countries or variations of lagers. Mm. I need to brush up on my international beers. Yeah. But yeah, guys. Well, no, well, dude, that's what I try to do here, man. This is German lager. Yeah. This is Ger this is mm. American lager. This is Canada lager. Yeah. Well, that, well, that, that is Canada lager. Right? Yeah, yeah. But this is more like craft Canada lager. Mm hmm And then the and then try to take it easy on you, because mm -hmm. I didn't think you would guess them to be honest. True. And I don't want people to be like, look at this, look at this clown. Yeah. <laughs> Can't guess the difference. But man, you oh. fucking crushed that, dude. Hey, you did a really good job too. Two out of four. Very similar styles. Wow. Damn. Good stuff. This Thanks. is a great. This is a great time. Thanks for the classes, man. Yeah, you're all, welcome. All the preparation. Oh, it's here. See, guys, if you're doubting what I say, you know it's working. It's working, guys. Because these Look are very this. same style, very similar. And he's got he's got two out of the four. Two out of the four. I do mean, that. It's it's been just it's just just a journey. Red like the journey. Perfect. There it is. <laughs>
All right, guys, if you really enjoy these videos, let me know down in the comment box below. Hit that like button, go subscribe, hit the little bell, all that fun stuff. Jordan, I want to thank you for joining me on this. Hey, thanks, for That was fun. We're going to do many, many more in the future. And with that said, that's going to do it for me. Maybe we're just going to, like we always say, crack a beer and enjoy. Cheers. Cheers.